Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'm having issues, not issues, but I'm probably in my car have a lot of turbo lag. So I called one of my partners who helped build the engine, uh, Bo McDonald's. Uh, I'm supposed to be meeting him and I'm gonna let him drive it and tell me what he thinks about the turbo lag. Um, trying to get it straightened out before I install the new turbo. I'm trying to get everything dialed, tuned in and everything like that. So he's gonna drive it and let me know uh, what he thinks is wrong with it. So let's go meet him and then, uh, and we'll see what's going on. All right, so I'm arriving. I'm arriving right here. Hopefully, this is Bo right here. So we'll see what's going on. You don't mind me videotaping this, do you? <laughs> what's going on, man? Not much. What's going on you? Ah. Oh shoot! Ah. You doing alright? Yeah, man, uh, the problem that I'm having is the, it's like a lot of lag when I take off of it. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, I just want you to drive it. I don't know if it's like the shift points or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Right. And, uh, what's your old dudes? I, I don't know, man. I, I'm going to let you look at it and let you uh, figure out what's going on. Okay. I got my computer if you want to look it up on the, on the uh, you know. So, I'll let you drive it. All right. the guy right there who uh, helped build the engine. So he's going to take a look at it. It's got a decent converter in it. Yeah, everything is built by uh, uh, David. You say? Yeah, and he built a, um, a transmission with a torque converter. So, so everything. And what I did, if you notice, you remember how rough it used to ride? Mm -hmm. uh, I disconnect the, um, uh, the that rear sway bar, the HR, it. and it rides a whole lot better. Same shocks or what? Everything. Well, I, I did a new, uh, put some new springs on it, new shocks, but it was still riding rough. So uh, I disconnect the uh, sway bar, and it rides a whole lot better. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the stock one back on, and uh, I'm gonna probably sell that one. Okay. You know, I just got it unattached right now. I ain't got the stock one back on it yet. Where's your lag coming from? Dead hit or? Just taking off. Or just like and if just, you're driving and kicking on No, it just like when I'm taking off, you can feel the, the shift. I want you to feel the shift. Uh, the shift is not like where I want it. I mean, you'll, you'll see like it's. And then, like, say, if you get on, you see, see, you feel a little lag. You know what I'm saying? Feel something. Yeah. But see, right when you get on, it picks up. It's just like when you take off, it's not as that quick. You know what I'm saying? I feel like it's shift when it shifts. It seems like it slows down a little bit to me, like a soft shift. It's not. It's not hard. I was thinking it's more like it's like running real rich or something like that. But like I said, I really don't, I don't know. That's odd. You got a car making noise and ain't a Buick. <laughs> <laughs> you feel that shift yeah, right there? That's that's not right. That cause you burn up the transmission, you're going too many gears ahead, and it's gonna cause it to slip and yeah. not you know shift. Another thing I need to get is my, I got a lot of stuff I need to do this car before I take it to the track or whatever. I still got some front suspension work I want to do. Your garage or that house right there? This guy's got a TA engine, Grand National. Oh, uh, really? Yep. That's where I just left. Oh, uh, really? You was over here? Yeah. <laughs> Clean. No, this thing is dirty, man. This is real dirty. Oof. Did you? Who did this? I, I don't know. I, I didn't do it. <laughs> we need to. We need to put a cable on it. That's gonna. That's gonna cause you burn the transmission. Really? 
Yeah, because this is all your uh, shift points are controlled here. Uh -huh. And they've got this locked out. And I'm going to try to move it back a little. You want me to get you a screwdriver and take it off? That's, no. Well, it's probably got a... It's got little teeth on it. Mm -hmm. it's, I bet they're stripped. And that's probably why they got that on there, because it'll go past them. It won't. Yeah, okay. I moved it back just a hair. We'll check it and see. So you basically I probably need a new detent cable or something yeah, pretty soon? Yeah, we need to get a new detent cable on it, because it'll cost you a transmission. Well, and I probably got one at the house that's good. Mm. If not, we'll order a new one. Um, but you got to be careful where you order them from, because some of them are no good, and they, they will cause you a lot of problems. So. All right. Well, let's just see but what this. We'll see what that adjustment did. It, it'll help a little. Okay. But, uh, well, than that, man, this rides real good. And I have another problem. Like I changed out my Alki pump, and you can see. Uh, leaking. Yeah, and I did everything, you know, to. Uh, now, you changed it out with a new one. Yeah. And when did you do this? Uh, probably about a month ago. And we need to get a hold of Julio. Is that whose it is? Yeah. We get a hold of him and he'll warrant you that. Tell him it's leaking and it's a new pump and yeah, you know, he'll get us another one. Okay. All right. But other than that, man, this thing rides good though. <laughs> you got a nice car. Make sure. Do your do your burnout. <laughs> you know, man. I gotta get rid of these tires anyway. You don't have his DA block on over. You can ride over if you want to. I mean, if you want to ride over and check messing with him. He took his car out to Valley the other night, 2060 foot. Oh, really? Went a 710 at a low, like 106 mile an hour uh -huh. with a 2060 foot. I gotta show you that turbo in my way. I got a bigger turbo. That's the reason why I'm gonna try to get this stuff straightened out and make Which sure. Which one you got on here? I don't remember. This right is a 67, 65. So and now I got a 67, like I got 60. Can't remember what I got from Bison. Thought that was him there for a minute. You see how, it's how long it takes to. I don't know if you can feel it. It just yeah, takes a long it, time it's to. It's kicking up again. It's kind of like taking off in second gear. So what's doing is kicking up a gear when it mm -hmm. shifts and then it's not coming back down. And it's because that, that decant cable's got a lot to do with it. They don't like it. I don't like them adjustment there. It don't act right. I mean, it's lucky for me that I don't get on it and I don't drive it that much. You know what I'm saying? So I know the... And another thing that I need to do is uh, get another steering box. I don't know if you can feel a lot of play in it and stuff like that. Uh, I want to try to get rid of that, so eventually well, we'll get your Jeep steering shaft. And get rid I already of got one. Oh, you got I one. I got one on here. Um, so it is the box. Yeah, I need to get the box. I got some upper control arms that need to be put on here. I got your. I got your box. Okay. Other than that, man, he just. Can you tell a difference in the ride? I mean, ride before. Is great. Yeah. Yeah, you see? We're in third. And we're going to change that. Yeah, we're already in third gear. And we can't even go See, I just, just quick, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. If this just feel like, like a lag or something, I don't... I wanted to pull hard all the way through the gears, you know what I'm saying? Right. It's not, uh... Try about right there, it's a little tighter. Yeah, it didn't hold good. It moved on us. Good Let's time. Good. Well, you, you got a lot of that, huh? What's that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Is that it? You want to yeah. check? Okay. Try that and see what. Right. That cable may be stretched, and maybe why they did that too. Why well, I just go ahead and get another one? Then. Yeah, we can turn it on the bottom. I uh, I bought some one from CK Performance. I sold it to Juni, and uh, that was pretty good. I like that little uh, uh, trans brake in it. This one don't have one. No, it don't. Mm -hmm. You said don't believe in them. He said you're 60 foot better without one. Oh, really? And my best 60 foot, believe it or not, is without one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's, but after it goes, it picks up. It just gets out there. I'm going to reset it the way we do it. From the original. Well, I'm going to try to. Make sure that we got our... There's our friend. <laughs> uh, oh, no, it's, it's an imitation. No, it's got a... Yeah, it's got a I if we got blue lights. He likes us. <laughs> <laughs> or pass him. <laughs> That's what y'all need, guys. <laughs> Let's see if I can. I'm gonna press the floor and see if it kicks out on it. All right. Do it again. Do it again. I didn't see it. Mm -hmm. It's like a clamp got it there. It's not moving. Yeah, see, it's um. Uh, usually you'll. Kind of adjust them, you set them all the way back and yeah. you smash the gas and adjust them. And oh, I, I gotta tighten, I'll tighten it up in a minute. I don't know what. You get a screwdriver with you? Yeah. Yeah, that's a strip. Now I'll see if I can push it out. Let's see if we can adjust this big tip. Oh, it came out. There's somewhere close to where you want it. Probably off of two to two, but I guess it's a start. It wasn't even tightened up, was it? It's just you. Must have. When I changed it, uh, gasket over here I must not tighten it up a little bit. So that's, that's not good. And they blew it off while we go. <laughs> <laughs> like I said I don't drive this thing that much. But like I say when I do drive I want to be you be want to be ready. But y'all did a good job on this. It should be a good motor man. It should make you a good one. up too he's just in this D10 cable <laughs> is that better? A better I'll see if we kick down Tell a lot, a lot of play in that steering wheel, ain't it? Yeah, yeah. it's too much. Still needs one more. Still shifting too quick. I think I'm just going to get another cable. Yeah, I, I think this, this is, I think. We're beating a dead horse. Yeah, yeah. So we'll do that. You know this neighborhood in there? No, I don't. They put a road in here if they want. <laughs>
Nah, no, nah, we, no, nah, I don't trust this area. I don't blame you. The Not the car, just the people. Well, I, don't know, I, don't know there. I don't either. We ain't gonna find out today. Not today. I don't feel like walking home. <laughs> This is this is way fast. This this is. I told you I figured it would be. Yeah. I it, mean, Camaro ain't no joke. Yeah. But, but I, I can feel the cheese when I get in this. I can feel it pulling. Yeah. As far as that Camaro, when you get into it, it just goes. But you can feel the cheese in this one when you pull. This thing here is. It's a serious motor, man. And it should be good and dependable for you. Yeah. Like that's just the only issue. That's the reason why I don't drive it. Just I'm just trying to figure out what's going on with that thing right there. And then I want to see about the temperature, about that fan. I don't need to. I need to keep that fan on high. You know what I'm saying? It's not on high. No, this it's working right. It's not. It's, okay. that, that's, it's not. I think it has your air conditioner has to be charged up or something like that. Oh, you know what I'm saying. Know. You think that we going back this way? Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, the air conditioner has to be charged in order for the high fan to come on or something like that. Yeah, because that's getting. Yeah, that's where it stays at. That ain't gonna kill one, but you don't want that all the time. No. Uh -uh. This thing rides a hundred times better. Than yeah, it. yes I it mean, does. That's why I said I'm gonna get rid of an HR bar and uh, you know seal it, and then I'm gonna put my stuff. That's worth money. Yeah, you know, that's what everybody's looking for now. So, other than that, man, it rides great. I can't believe how it rides. A whole lot, hundred percent better, ain't it? He ain't beat you to death. I don't know the way my grandma got home that time. I was like, man, you pissed me off right now. It beat you to death. And I, like I say, I, I, that's what it was. Just that, I guess. What sway bar is it? There was an HR sway bar. I had a guy call me yesterday and bought one. How much he uh, want to pay for? I got paid good money. I mean, uh, what are they new? Uh, uh, I don't remember. I came about four hundred something. Well, let me know. I'll take this off. I, I'm off tomorrow, and I can unhook it. And, uh, and I'll tell you, it's somebody local, too. You barge down. Mm. Okay. Well, if you, if, you, if you find a guy, just let him know that I got one that I'm going to get rid of. I mean, we just got to come up with a price or something like that, you know. Yeah, I call him right here a second ago. Because I got my stock, and I'm going to put it back on. I got one, uh, it's called a Hellwig. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, yeah. It's just a hair bit bigger than stock. I've got one of them laying outside the garage. I mean, I want to use something just a little bit better, but not quite like it is. Yeah. Tell you the truth, I don't really not, not that many. Trust me, I did not that many. So I didn't write them down. Really I'm gonna probably about a, less than a thousand, I guess, because it's motor seems solid. Yeah. You got a solid car, man. It's nice. So, so yeah, we definitely need to get that decant fixed. Yeah. Before you have to spend another thirty-five hundred dollars. Well, you got that right. Hey guys, I just left Bo as we determined my detent cable. Um, car shipped away too early a little bit but I'm going to order a new one and uh, we're going to install it and see what it'll do um, like I say if you need anything Bo is the man to get if you need some parts whatever I'll leave, leave his description below uh, he'd like to say he's the one to help build the engine in this car it's a beast it's a beast so we're going to replace the dente cable and see where they go and hopefully it'll fix my issue with the turbo leg you see it's shifting too quick and uh and we could term that the detent cable is, um, I don't know, it's kind of wore out. So I'm gonna go order another one, and then we're gonna get it replaced next weekend, or a couple weekends, I think he said, and then we'll let you know. So if you like this video, please like, share, subscribe, you know what to do. I'm out, peace.